Welcome to Race Crews. Can I help you? Hey, I'm going to give you a quick tour of my new warehouse. The one that I used to have, 1,440 square feet, just wasn't enough. Oh, by the way, I'm not going to use a microphone. Just a quick tour, okay? Uh, 1,440 was not enough. How about 3,000, over 3,100 feet? You want to check it out? Oh, yeah, by the way, when you're working with shelves and stuff, you don't want to bend over and hit your head on a shelf. You get little cocos like this. So, which store should we take? One, two, yeah, we'll go that way. But before we do, look, air conditioning. Working air conditioning. This room, this room, that room, and I got another room over there, separate air conditioning. Ugh, let me tell you, it's great to have air conditioning. I'm sweating right now because I've been working in the warehouse and I didn't necessarily, don't need to run the air if I'm over there working in the warehouse. So right here, this room, uh, oh, by the way, when I was switching, somebody was still here. So she basically gave me room to move stuff here, and then she moved stuff. So I thought this was going to be what I call my blue room. Let's check it out. I'm sure you recognize the blue background, and there's my blue carpet that I would use for that one uh, table. Well, now you get to see my table, how I built it. I actually built it with two pieces. This side right here, it's, it's actually on wheels. So this way I can roll this through a door, but... I like my tables 40 inches wide. Well, you can't roll it 40 inches wide. So if you look, I had a little piece in the back. See, and that would support it. Uh, that would support the back so that uh, I can have all the pieces. And right here, you can see I have plywood on top, and that would give me a nice flat surface for the whole thing. Anyways, well, I started setting up my blue room here, and uh, guess what? This room actually, it actually has windows. And unfortunately, this blue room's covering the windows. I would like to see that way because it's kind of a nice, not a nice view, but I get to see outside. Right now, I have things blocked off because I don't want people to know what I'm doing just yet uh, for security reasons, right? You don't want people just uh, breaking in. They might see stuff and next thing you know, you got a security problem. But uh, now, let's go ahead and go to that door. Oh yeah, I'm going to cheat. I'm going to use this cart. <laughs> Ooh, more room. I actually had all sorts of stuff packed in here. But um bum but um bum In order for me to move, I, I had this thing packed with all my tubs. And you've probably seen another video. I kind of showed lots and lots of tubs. I have everything in tubs. Makes it easier. And I thought I was going to set up my, my other filming table. You know, I had Super 6 lane on an alternate table. The black background. And then I had the green... Uh, tablecloth I mean a green carpet on top well it didn't quite work because actually now I'm, I want to put this uh, filming table in the other room because I'm gonna put it like an L like I had in my uh, old in my garage I had a table this way and then I had a table this way so all this I got to move over there and then the blue one's got to go this way but nonetheless wait okay. remember that track set remember that track set remember that one over there Let's go ahead and take a look over here. Bum -ba -dum, bum -ba -dum. And there's the warehouse. Oh yeah! All together, everything, like I said, 3,000, over 3,100 feet. Well, let's just, I just remembered something. Let's talk about this. That room over there is going to be for like unboxing videos. So it'll basically be quick unboxing videos or things that I can do set up in one spot. But that blue is going to come over here. So this will be more my track room, right? So I'll, have, uh, I'll be able to do track time right here. I can do track, track time on the floor. Brand new carpet, by the way. So I'll be able to do track time on the floor. Oh, yeah, my blue rug. I still have my blue rug. It's right there. It's all rolled up. I got to get that thing flattened out. Otherwise, it might, uh, it might not roll flat again. So that's the purpose of these rooms. This will be basically like my track room. I can set up a super six lane. I can set up a track time. Uh, I've been working on the track time channel. If you haven't noticed, I already uh, already have quite a few videos on my track time channel. I'm uploading snippets so that you can tell I'm working on my track time channel. And that's what this room is going to basically be for. Getting some track time videos done. Now let's check out the warehouse. So over here... Here's more tubs. I'm doing some sorting because at first 
basically what I was doing is I was just uh, getting stuff out of the old warehouse and then getting them uh, put over here. I have all my stuff palletized over there. I got a lot of stuff back over there. Oh yeah, check it out. I got a, two roll-up doors. So this way over there, I can park my Lamborghini. And then over here, I can park my Avalanche. Should be sitting pretty in no time. But what I really look forward to doing is getting my old big downhill tracks set up. You know, I used to, uh, I used to do downhill racing birthday parties and stuff. So like in this area, I plan on having a couple downhill racing tracks. Uh, that's all I'll say about that. I don't want to spill the beans on everything just yet. Over here, mm, people are wondering about the Race Screws Gaming Channel. Let's go ahead and pop into this one. This is a nice room right here, nine by 18 feet. Nine by 18 feet. I don't remember, hopefully I don't have any addresses. But I was thinking about making this my gaming room. Now there's gonna be an echo because it's empty. Got a hard floor, hard walls, it's gonna have echo. But I'll take care of all that later. So I still plan on Race Screws Gaming. I could do it at home or I can do it here. So Race Grooves Gaming is definitely in the works. Right now there's my computer set up for editing. And so that's the plan. Right here, Race Grooves Gaming. Over there, Track Time Channel and Track Time for Race Grooves. It's always nice to have an office. By the way, those are her cabinets right there. She's not quite uh, done. Check it out. Bathrooms. Woo! Ooh, so many bathrooms it's gotta have bathrooms and uh, this is where you came in you just don't know it yet there you go nice little view the view is better out of that or other corner so uh, hopefully I get that set up soon oh I almost forgot to tell you something but I can't stand here talking to you look uh, look at the light I gotta let me move okay that's a bit better so where am I located? I'm in Montebello, California. That's where my studios are. Uh, if you go to Facebook, uh, I have my address on my Ray Screws uh, Facebook page, okay? There's two pages, by the way. Long story, Facebook, whatever. One's Ray Screws Studio, and then another was uh, Ray Screws. Uh, you can find them, search it. Oh, by the way, uh, there's one that is not me, okay? Make sure the address says uh, Ray Screws and the other one says Ray Screws Studio. The one that says like Ray Screws Photo Album or something, that's not me, okay? But hey, follow those pages if you would like updates, okay? And as far as visitors, please, no visitors just yet. I'm going to set up some time. I'll have a schedule to where people can visit if they'd like to visit. But uh, this is where I work, okay? I can't have people coming in and out and I can't get nothing done. Anyways, thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.